Tonight, Five investigates with new details about the state's training academy for court officers, which has been under fire for months. Our Mike Bodet has been reviewing a report which contains disturbing findings and calls for major changes at the academy. And Mike is here now live. Mike. Maria, this independent report is highly critical of the culture of the trial court officer academy and the abuse that was piled on recruits. One new court officer described being petrified at the academy as a recruit and still has nightmares. Now the trial court security director has resigned and the academy has been shut down. Ready, set, begin. This is video from inside the Massachusetts Trial Court Officer Academy at Westover Air Reserve Base, an eight-week program for newly hired court officers that includes two weeks where recruits stay overnight. The video shows the physical ability test recruits must pass to become court officers. But this report from the Massachusetts Trial Court Officer Academy assessment team paints a much darker picture of what really went on there. According to the report, the problems date back to 2014 when a paramilitary training model was implemented as part of a charge to professionalize the academy. The report calls this approach flawed and ill-advised and something more applicable to law enforcement rather than court officers. Many recruits from various classes described a culture of fear, intimidation, humiliation, disrespect, punishment-based discipline, and retaliation. Recruits told investigators about repeated incidents in which they were struck in the face or strangled by senior academy staff. The trial court says it will take all action that's necessary to address the problems outlined in the report and is exploring and developing plans for training to meet the court's short-term security needs. Meantime, two managers in the trial court security department remain on leave. Mike Bodette, Five Investigates. Mike, thanks for that.